Hi, I'm Stuart Lambert from Forces, and today I want to do a quick demo of the SGX encryption and how users can create and manage their own passwords. Uh, what I've got here is a small uh, test email with an attachment which I'm going to send through uh, now to try and set up a quick email. Uh, there are many ways of setting up rules. Uh, popular ones are things like setting a high importance email, always gets encrypted, or as we have done at the moment, if you type encrypt in square brackets, that also sets off the encryption rule. Uh, what I'll do is I'll quickly send this now. Uh, this is our Gmail account as well as set up the Forces demo, so it'll take a second for the email to come through. Let's refresh the inbox. And you see, we've got the email now. Uh, this is an SPX requ uh, registration request. Uh, because I haven't had a encrypted email to this email address before, it's saying Stuart Lambert uh, from Forces over here has sent you an encrypted message. Uh, and before you can receive and view the email, you need to register your password to act. Uh, and this is the link which takes you back to the appliance, which is your Broadband Geek Alliance. What you have here is your own self registration, so it, it auto fills the email address for you. And what you have to do is put in your own password. And we've set relatively uh, tough rules on saying the password must be minimum of eight characters and alphanumeric. This is completely uh, customizable to make it as secure as you want for the end user. Uh, there is also the option for the end user to have password recovery, which they can uh, finish themselves. So what they do is uh, they can choose from a preset list of questions, or they can uh, you can create your own. I'm just going to quickly enter some of these. So we get a little bit of information about my uh, about me. Let's make this is nice and quick. There we go. Uh, one thing you can't do is they can't select the same question three times. It's quite secure. To be able to register, they have to be three separate questions. So I'm going to quickly register this now. There you go. We've successfully registered. Uh, and now this email, uh, we'll get another email come through to the Gmail account in a moment. As you can see, I've sort of pop-up come up to my Outlook saying some, uh, someone has signed up to the actual encrypted email I've sent, so it notifies the user that it's been sent. Here you go, here's the SPX in, uh, demo I sent a minute ago. Now you notice that the email contents isn't directly displayed here. We actually have a PDF down here. Now this wrapper is a PDF wrapper around the email and the attachment I sent. So let me quickly download this. Just quit making this. And you see this is the PDF. Now this is where it asks for the password I set up a moment ago. So I'm just going to quickly log in. And here we go. Now this is completely brandable here, so you could have your uh, a trust or a business organisation details here, and you can customise that completely. Uh, and what you'll see here is you've got the email I sent, and then all the attachments. And you'll see that the gifts from my signature have also gone into the attachments, but all the details are still there. You've got a secure reply button here, so you can reply back encrypted uh, without uh, to the sender again, so without having to actually do an encrypt or anything like that will work from there. And then there's also the uh, original PDF I attached is there as well, uh, which you can uh, open up as normal. As I say, it really is as easy as that. Thanks for your time.